Hey all, welcome to Parkers Reefs. Today's episode, we're gonna check out some incredibly rare wrasse that have just landed here at Deer Park Aquarium. And there's a good bit of a story behind it, so I thought I'd uh, check them out and uh, bring you guys along for the ride. So let's head on in and check out these fish. Hey Dave, how are you going? Good, yeah. Good, thanks. Here you've got some pretty special uh, wrasse in here, particularly as a pair. Can you tell us a bit about them? So these are the green eye or sunset wrasse. Um, with the pair in there, male with the yellow. I got the world's first pair in about two weeks ago. We sold them to a, a client and I decided just from that, with the tail alone on the male, once it gets a bit older, it's a bit lunate-like, I decided I'd grab the other pair and probably end up in one of the displays here but if someone wants them they're up for sale as well. Simply beautiful fish. Now these, these are, <laughs> this is only the second pair that's available for sale because they've only just recently been discovered and classified, is that, that true? They were discovered in 2017 by Monsoon Aquatics and got classified in 2017 and it's the first individuals that have been collected for sale since then. And that's from up in Darwin, Australia? Yeah, through the Darwin facility. They're named after one of the divers, Tim Green. They're from the Timor Sea. Timor Sea. These guys, I assume, were collected as a pair? Collected as a pair. Yep, yep. Yeah, if someone wants them, they're up for sale. They're definitely not cheap. They're a, you know, the first of anything is always quite expensive. For but, sure. Um, someone that wants to collect something rare and exclusive. Definitely a collector's type of fish. Because, I mean, I don't know if it's just me, but I wouldn't say they're the most amazing wrasse I've ever seen in my life. No, very similar to a Naoki wrasse. Um, but once that male develops that tail, that tail is what suckered me right in. Definitely unique, yeah, yeah. Beautiful. Well, it's such an opportunity just to, um, just to be able to see these fish in person, let alone uh, potentially even buy them. Not that, uh, not that they're going to end up in my tank, but... Um, best part of my job is the experience I get some of the animals that I get to experience while they're in my care is just the most rewarding thing ever perfect and if they sell awesome and if I have them in my display I'm I'm not and yeah, that doesn't bother me more, so. <laughs> fair enough if anyone is interested in the pair they should contact you through your Facebook page yeah, you can shoot us a message on Facebook and we can discuss it they are a four figure fish and quite a way up there as well. Um, it will be the second pair ever sold in the world. Um, and they've settled in, you can see how fat they are. Yeah. They, they eat pretty much everything. They're eating flake, pallets, frozen food. I know they're in the rubble tank here, but they've been, um, every time I get the camera out and try to get some footage of them, they're just uh, picking away through all the uh, little uh, frag tiles and uh, rubble in there looking for any little things they can nibble on. I'll come up to my fingers first feed in the morning but they get spoiled so they get a bit used to it by this time. <laughs> yeah, fish of this sort of magnitude have no shortage of food supplied to them so they tend not to... Uh... extra attention for sure. <laughs> they don't feed like maniacs when you put uh, food in the tank because uh, they know they've got a steady, steady stream of it. Alright guys, we might wrap this video up there. A huge congratulations to Tim Green and Monsoon Aquatics for discovering this fish and getting it classified. And of course, a massive thank you to David Deer Park Aquarium for going out and ordering such expensive fish for us to enjoy and also get this video for you guys at home to watch. Of course, if you are interested in these fish, reach out to Dave via his Facebook page and see if we can work out some sort of deal to get them in your home aquarium. Other than that, guys, I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, comments, feedback, Pop it in the comments section down below. If you enjoyed the video, please do give it a thumbs up. And last but not least, if, least if you are yet to subscribe, please consider doing so. It'll take two seconds of your time, cost you no money at all. Other than that, guys, I will leave you with it. Till next time, stay safe and keep reefing. Bye.